Hey guys, how's it going? Justin here with Waltz, and today I'm here with my system designer, Matt Lowe, and we're in one of our customers' homes who was so nice to let us use their awesome video wall that we set up for them for a demo. Now, Matt, what is going on here in terms of video? Yeah, so we have four Samsung QN85QN900B. These are 8K, 85-inch televisions, and if you wanna learn more about them, check out Justin's video on this particular television that he did earlier. Very, very cool, but can you dive into a little bit more about how we're getting video on four, it looks like four different screens here. How do we do that? Yeah, so on this 170 inches of 8K video that we have here, we're using uh, Just Had Power System so that we can bring in video through Roku, DirecTV, uh, Dish Network, DVD player, whatever you want. Um, so in this case, we're using it in that uh, video wall mode. So we have four independent sources so that we can watch multiple games, have the news on, weather, whatever you want. Um, the whole system allow you to pick and choose, and then you can put it into the big view mode. That's pretty crazy, 170 inches of 8K. Um, but I mean, the next question obviously is audio. How do we do audio here? Sounds provided with a Denon uh, AVR system providing about a thousand watts of power to nine Klipsch in-wall and in-ceiling speakers. So that we have a fully immersive Dolby Atmos surround sound system for any of these sources at any one time. And then if you wanna watch a big movie, then you can put on 170 inches of big movie and then still have a nine channel Dolby Atmos surround sound system to be well immersed into the content. That's really awesome. Now, the only thing that might worry some people is remotes. I mean, there's four TVs, tons of different devices. How do we get by with all the remotes? Yeah, that's one of the products that we also offer and do installations for is Control 4. So this entire system can be operated with a single button press. We can use voice control and we can use even just simple light switches on the wall that are pre-programmed to set up everything automatically for you. So a single button press and you're watching TV right away. Very, very cool setup we have here. And if you guys are interested in programming your own smart home and learning more about how to do that, you can check out our Patreon course, which I'll leave that link down in the description. If you guys want to you know, get something like this for your own system and you're here in the Phoenix Metro Valley, we can definitely help you out. So give us a call and we can set something up to where Matt can design your own system. If you guys wanna see more you know, off the grid content like this, make sure to leave a like and subscribe and we'll see you guys in the next one. All right guys, so now we're gonna talk about actually using the multi-display manager in the home. So we need to be able to have an easy interface for friends, family, ourselves, to actually control four different TVs at one time with the SR260, the Neo, the Halo remote.